All right, let's do this. Let me show you how you can go from Quizlet, export it into a quizzes in as quick a time as possible. Are you ready? Okay. So from here, what you're going to want to do is once you have your actual like, quiz, you're going to want to export it. So you can go over here, three little dots, export, and it kind of gives you a bunch of different options here, right? And then just grab everything, copy text, and then here's what you're going to want to do. So I'm just going to do my library. I was kind of messing around earlier. And so let's just say you're opening a new quiz or you're editing a quiz and you want to import from a spreadsheet. All right. So the first thing you want to do is download that sample spreadsheet. That's just a nice template for you. All right, so here I am. I've downloaded this template. And so remember, I copied the questions. So I'm just going to hit paste. And you see, it doesn't work perfectly, but pretty close. So the text of the question is there, which is great. But this isn't my question type. This is the answers. So what I would probably do here is just put this for wherever you want the option base of. I just copy it right over here. Let's just say for option one, because you can always scramble around and then you want them to be multiple choice questions. I would assume you can choose the question type you want, but let's just make it all multiple choice for now. That's what you want to do. And so here are the options for question type one, and then you put your other options. So one plus one equals two, but maybe you want it to be three, four, and five, and so on and so forth. All right, I'm just gonna make them all 15, 16, 17, because I know those are all wrong answers for all of these. And like I said, you can copy them to be whatever you want them to be. All right, but here I am. So now I have my option one, which is the right answers, option two. And then I have no option five, I don't need that. All right, so then for correct answer, you're gonna choose the option choice, so not the answer. So let's just say I made all of them option one is the right answer. So I'm just gonna make all of these option one. And then the timing that you want each question to be. I mean, you do whatever you want, but let's just make them all 20 seconds for now. And then if you want any sort of image to go with them, you can upload the link there. But again, I'm gonna keep this as simple as possible. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save this. I'm gonna export it as an Excel because I'm not on Excel right now. So make sure that you use Excel or you download it to Excel. All right, and this will be called math. All right, I'm going to grab this here, import from spreadsheet. I'm going to grab this math one. I call this one actually math two. And so when you do that, you'll see everything looks good. It's got the question, the type of question, which you could always change here if you mess that up. You can also edit everything in here. If somehow again, anything got messed up, it'll let you know if anything's wrong. Boom, 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 what the correct answer is, timing, and then you hit import. And then, because I already had some questions here, let's just scroll down to the bottom, and here you go. One plus one equals two. And you see every single one is that first option, but as long as when you do the quiz, you put on the one that says like shuffle answer responses, well, then it won't always be the first one. And again, you could always through, go through and modify. But that is how you go from Quizlet to quizzes.